Hello everyone, it's Koneko here, and today's video is a wish haul video. Basically, things that I got from Wish that are Harry Potter related. Okay, so I was browsing Wish like one does and looking at all the cheap things and wondering, do I do it? Uh, there was some things that popped up that were like free, 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 and then you pay shipping. Uh, and then it takes forever to get to you. And sometimes the thing doesn't even like show up ever and um, you still have to go complain to them that you never got um, your Felix liquid luck. How unlucky. Anyways, what I did got are these items here. So some of them are presents uh, that my mom said were from Wish. So we'll just, I, I've seen them on Wish, so I'm gonna bring them up. And they're Harry Potter related, and I love Harry Potter. I'm a Gryffindor. I'm obsessed with Harry Potter, the world of Harry Potter. Uh, yeah, so here we go. I got this necklace here, this top, this eyeshadow palette, and a necklace that didn't show up from Wish in one sort of like order. And I got this Ginny Weasley wand a while ago, quite a while ago, before summer I think, because I just, I needed a quick, fast, cheap, Ginny Weasley wand for some pictures and then I've got a couple items here that are gifts but I also saw that you could order them on Wish and I have the brushes that go with the set but I got them on Amazon and they're in my Amazon um like what I got Boxing Day or what I got on Amazon last year around Christmas time I had like what I got for Christmas what I got for Boxing Day and like Amazon haul Because uh, we got some like Amazon gift cards and, and whatnot for Christmas. So yeah So now I have the eyeshadow palette as well and it looks beautiful There's this big sticker on the back like a Mailing thing? I don't know. I don't know if this is legit, but it's got a bunch of information, story, book, cosmetics, although that T looks like an L. Uh oh. So, <laughs> um, once upon a time, maybe this is fake, but you know, it had a blue check mark and it wasn't free with just paying shipping. I forget what it was and I think my screenshots that I have aren't the prices that I got them at because I went back later and was like oh I should probably screenshot all the things I got and be able to show people because I'm, I'm such a great youtuber <laughs> um there were three sisters who never stopped believing in fairy tales and they all lived I think it says happily ever after under there but I can't pick that off so sleeve cardboard sleeve tops right off um, wizardry and witchcraft eyeshadow palette, storybook cosmetics. And I don't know if the one, if the, um, the brushes I got on Amazon are, like, authentic or anything either. Um, if anybody knows, like, this sort of thing. I guess that could, no, it looks like an L. I don't know. It looks like a typo on the back there, but it's probably too hard with the focus to actually... Anywho, so, closes with a magnet, opens, got the like detector thing, we don't need that. It doesn't have any names on it, the names are all here, it's got a mirror. <laughs> okay, um, so we have, it's cursive and shiny, um, broomstick, sorcerer, like, Am I just blind? I don't know what that one says. Okay, potions. 
Is there like a list on the back? Because apparently I can't read cursive. This one's Bewitched. Jinx. Charms. Spellbook. Cavern? I, I, honestly, I don't even know. Like, is it a typo? I can't tell. Um, maybe there's a list online that I can put side by side. Or like, maybe you can decipher them or you know what they are already. I am so sorry. Okay. So it's not a bad size palette and like the back part folds over. So that's good. Um, I'm not really a, like a beauty guru, but like the first one felt really creamy. Oh, yeah, they're pretty creamy. But, and that's showing up pretty good. And like I'm barely touching it, like the whole thing that, that they do. I'm gonna run out of fingers here. But like, that looks really pretty. I don't wanna wipe it on my new Christmas pants. <laughs> I should've brought a makeup wipe in. Told ya, not a beauty guru. Oh, that, that one that I used with my thumb would be really good as a highlighter. It just looks really shiny and pretty. Okay, so, so far so good, like on my fingers. I mean, they're not really coming off. <laughs> I hope I don't get everything dirty now. Okay, that's the palette. Awesome. Maybe I'll do a look with this for a video maybe where I'll use this and then I'll use the Harry Potter brushes and maybe I'll try to do something creative Harry Potter themed because again, I love Harry Potter. I'm obsessed. Maybe it could be a bit Harry Potter in like book, like theme -y. Then I'll talk about what I'm wearing. Um, so I got this necklace, it's platform nine and three quarters, super cute, simple. Um, the shipping was probably like five bucks or something and I, yeah, I'd probably, if this was five bucks with free shipping, like I'd probably buy it. Um, yeah, super cute. Um, I think when I took the screenshot, it was like three dollars or something. And I don't know if the shipping was still the same because I already bought it so I didn't like click on it to check. But yeah, there's that. Uh, this top was, um, I think it was $11, but the, it was pretty cheap shipping. But the material is really thin. Um, it's super cute, super comfy and casual. Um, I'm wearing like a black bra underneath and I'm pretty sure you could see it, but like I don't really care about that kind of stuff personally. Um, I think this would be a good shirt for in the summer when it's hot and you want to represent uh, your Potterheadness. And uh, yeah, comfy, thin, that good kind of like material that I never know what it's called, similar to like my Sailor Moon t-shirt that I got from Peachy Shop, that sort of material. So like I feel like it wouldn't matter if you like sweat in it, you wouldn't like see <laughs> or notice. Um, and then my, oh, the thing that didn't come that was supposed to with these items was a little necklace of liquid luck. And of course, I don't have liquid luck, so I was very unlucky and it didn't show up in the mail. Yet. I mean, I guess it could still come, it was like... It was like $2 with like $3 shipping or something. So yeah, that didn't come yet, but that's okay. On to my wand. I was gonna like scream if it wasn't in here, but here it is. It was $15 and free shipping. Yes, there are free shipping items on Wish. I almost always look for items everywhere with free shipping, even if the price like for shipping is like hidden in the item. I don't know. There's just something about it saying free shipping and I'm like sold. <laughs> but this was only $15 and like there's a few little like bumps or like a little nick thing here. A little bit of damage or whatever that's a bit annoying and the box is a bit rugged and uh, damaged but 
how I hold the wand, like you can't see that. It's perfect for pictures. It's like the detailing of Ginny Weasley's wand. I mean, I've got Hermione's wand and Harry Potter's wand from like Universal Studios and like Hermione's is like the interactive one. Uh, Harry's isn't because I didn't think I needed two and it's a bit more expensive for the interactive one. But like, I already have some like authentic wands that are like from Universal Studio and like maybe this one is, it's just a little like bit damaged. It's got a good core to it. I'm pretty sure it said metal core. Metal core. Yeah, so I mean it does the trick for photos and magic. <laughs> Alright, couple items that were gifts but I did specifically see on Wish and um, like this was a birthday present um, and they said they got it online and mom said Wish so we'll see but it's got like a magnetic clasps here what it looks like. Harry Potter. It's got the Hogwarts crest and you open it and it looks really nice and cool. Do, do, do. It's got some imagery. That's cool. Paper coloring. Awesome. And then it breaks down like you know what you do each day each month sort of thing with other images throughout and then there's like the DA back here I think that's just for like extra notes uh yeah free notes and then there's like stuff like that and whatnot so yeah really cool I'm gonna start using it like now for like the new year <laughs> my mom saw this fidget spinner it's a golden snitch um I'm amused easily, so I think that's why she was like, yeah, I'll get her them things them kids use. Like, look at it go! That's smooth. It's really heavy though, like trying to balance it. And then like if you put it on your side, so on the side it starts to slow down because it's so heavy. And sharp. Like they're, it's quite sharp. <laughs> ah! I don't know if that would hurt anybody's eyes. Also, for my birthday, I got another time turner, which is crazy. Like, yeah, I have like three of these. One's like a cheap plastic from Chapters. This one is pretty decent quality. Like, it looks pretty cool, feels pretty good. And then I have like an actual one uh, that my husband got me from Universal Studios. And the one he got me, like, you spin the side and it like spins. And it clasps together the same way that, oh, focus! <laughs> and it clasps together the same way that my other ones do. And this little cute music box, this wooden little thing. Oh, it says Harry Potter on the inside there with like the style writing. And it's got that stuff there. And so you just hold it open and then you... Oh, <laughs> that's just like the sound of like pure like nostalgia and just like growing up with that and having it as my safe space. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> all right. So the items that I got in a little haul, um, including like the one that I got earlier because it was a Wish Harry Potter item and then some extra Harry Potter uh, wish items that I got as gifts. I absolutely love them all. If you love Harry Potter, let me know. I want to know like how much you love it or you know if you don't like it, you don't have to say you know I hate it, it's stupid. <laughs> it's okay if you don't like it or if you don't like it, what fandom do you like? I like a lot Doctor Who, Sherlock, a lot of nerdy stuff. 
Um, and what house are you in if you are in a house and did you take the Pottermore quiz? I took the Pottermore quiz and I got Gryffindor. There's a video somewhere on this account where I actually like filmed myself taking the test and got Gryffindor and I was super happy about it. <laughs> um, I have lots of qualities of Hufflepuff, um, a couple qualities of Ravenclaw and a little bit of Slytherin qualities too. I th so like I have appreciation for all different characteristics of the different houses and stuff. So no hate to any house that you might be in. They all have their own unique qualities. And that's it for this video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. And I hope that you enjoyed the video and I hope to see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs> I could play that forever. <laughs>